I will show you how you can create an awesome text effect using a perspective tool in just some few minutes on Pixel App. If you are new to the channel, kindly subscribe and turn on post notification. Without much ado, let's get started. Right now, I want you to go to your layer, background layer, select from gallery, use this image, kindly check the image in the video description, the image link. In the video description and select a 4x3 size break it right down click on the check mark you have this now go to your text area bring in your text Select OK. So bring down your text. Go to color and use a white color. Increase it in size. Go to your font area and use the Manga Night Bold. This is the font I'm using. Click OK. Increase the text in size a bit. Bring it right up here. Look around for the perspective too. So this is it. Click on it. Without enabling it yet, pull down this color this way and pull this point also down here without enabling the perspective tool yet. So let's do that. Now enable your perspective tool, click on the check mark, awesome, that's it, you are not satisfied with the size, go back to text size and increase it in size depending on your likeness, you can use native position to make sure this is on the middle and you can even bring it down using the position button you can do some adjustments all depends on you leave that to that now go to the shape area in order to make it real select this square shape make it a rectangle spread it across Break it right down here. Come down to gradient. So select the gradient option. Select the plus button. Set out your gradient color by clicking here and uh, here to give the opacity of the first color click ok click ok and you have this click on your check mark to ok everything you've done now you can make this bigger you go to texture select texture make sure the shape that we have just created highlighted select texture then go back to the image that we are using as background and select the dark portion of it so we are basically selecting the tar root click on your check mark and you have this enable maintain ratio now you can see that everything is so real you can proceed to perspective to bring the the shape upwards so 
so let's make this shape bigger and bring it here and carefully position it like so go to relative position and make sure it's on the middle i think it's much more bigger so we can reduce it a bit you can just position it here use relative position to make sure everything is stacked to the middle that's it the last thing you can do is to save your work and that is it hope you like it please kindly subscribe to the channel turn on post notification so we see you in our next tutorial thank you for watching